right, Clark Kent, or as they call you, the Man of Steel. More like the Man of Shit, because you've been doing a pretty shitty job of keeping this entire planet safe. Well, oh yeah, Vegeta, I mean Batman, or as they call you, the Dark Knight. More like the Dark... You're a fucker. Yeah, that's right. I said it. You're a fucker, huh? Yeah. No, oh, I cannot believe you called me a fucker. I'm telling my mom, Martha. Wait a minute. Your mom's name is Martha, too? Wait, you have a mother named Martha? Oh, shit. Well, I guess we gotta be best friends now. Alright, what is up? This is Slow Plays back in some more Dragon Ball Z Universe 2. So today, guys, we are trying out a sick new mini mod pack, my friends, my dudes. This is going to be a sick costume pack with a couple of new skills as well. Very excited because my two homies, these are the OGs, the boys I grew up with in this community. I mean, not really grow up with, but like, these guys are OGs in the community. Uh, one of the very first couple of modders that I met, and they're still out here making these amazing mods. So big shout outs to the homies, Cali Kings, as well as Leon Exodio, my friends, my dudes. It is time for the Man of Steel Goku and the Dark Knight Vegeta. Yes, you already know it, dude. These look so sick. So I've actually covered stuff like this in the past where we have like a Vegeta and Goku DC sort of crossover. The like crossover packs where they fuse together with Batman and freaking Superman and all that great stuff. There have been a ton of those. But these right here are actual legitimate basic simplistic costumes you know that's all you need costumes and some sick movesets here uh i feel like it's been a while since we've had anything in terms of like a marvel or dc crossover for xenoverse 2 and uh i just love the fact that uh leon as well as cali they just come through and uh, these were actually supposed to be for halloween but they released a little bit later but it's all good you can play and enjoy these at any point in time uh these just look fantastic the logo on goku's chest is really outstanding i love just like the bevel and emboss it's got going on there you know shout out to photoshop <laughs> oh we got the cape and everything his just coloration on it looks awesome and if you guys didn't notice it is actually the revamped models from the hair you can definitely tell especially from the back i think now i've gotten a good uh sense of what the revamp looks like but yes man is still goku and dark knight vegeta he actually has the mask which is fantastic and the logo on his uh, torso and everything looks great too and he's got his little utility belt so before we get into it, my friends if you could do me a massive gargantuan titanic favor and smash that like button that would be so freaking amazing i would truly really appreciate it plus it shows that you guys want to see more dragon ball xenoverse 2 content here on the channel as well as a continuation of the mod series so skill set here we got a just a ton of awesome skills for goku i think Vegeta only has one skill, but it's a-okay. It's gonna be fun. Uh, I did change up a couple of things, so the custom skills that are equipped for this mod is going to be Laser Beam. We also have Super Breath and Super Laser Beam Blast. So, I'm assuming he's gonna have the laser eyes. I really hope that's the case. He also has, uh, I threw on the Alpha Kamehameha Super God Fist, which I think was on there already. Uh, Final Charge was already on there. And he does have uh, all three forms of Super Saiyan. Now, I would like to see an update for this. If maybe they get the God or Blue forms, I think that'd be sick. But just traditional, normal, one, two, and three Super Saiyan. Just staying basic today, my friends, because uh, we out here being white, girls. Let's go. Let's go. And then we got my man Dark Knight Vegeta here with a Big Bang Launcher Blazing Attack. The Batarang is making a comeback. We got the Batarang. I think there was a skill like this I covered in the past. I think it was for a Batman Vegeta Fusion, if I'm not mistaken. But... We also got to have the Burning Strike, Final Charge, Gamma, Prominence Flash, Explosive Wave, and he has all of his respective Super Saiyan or Super Vegeta forms, and the Super Soul, and don't come back again. Yeah, so, yeah, enjoy. Yeah, the full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku, even though it's base form. Let's go, dude! Let's freaking go! So, they're going to have their little voice interaction and stuff as well, which is going to be sick. Uh, best stage to go to, I guess, would be the Future in Ruins, because I'm trying to make this... Like a Batman versus Superman, Dawn of Justice. This will be Goku versus Vegeta, Dawn of the Saiyans. We're going to officially dub it that because I can. I have all the power to do it. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Vegeta. Sorry, but I'm going to use my full power. You always manage to be one step ahead of me. You're as annoying as always. That never gets old, especially when you're doing modded versions of the characters, just because you see Goku and freaking... I mean, they're both in tights. Like, both of them are skin tight. Like, if 
If y'all are into that, there you go. Enjoy. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to try Goku's overall moveset and everything. Um, as you guys know, with these, it's just pretty basic stuff. There's not really something that you could make, like, super custom. I mean, if you wanted to, you could. But uh, I think basic Goku's moveset is very fitting for a Superman. He's got the kicks, the punches, all the attacks. And I love the physics on the cape. The physics on the cape look great. Everything is phenomenal my dude so we got laser beam eyes dude yo that is so sick dude hold on we gotta check that out again goku coming through oh my god why does that look so sick dude so it's like death beam but it's got like purple on the edges with little sparkles and then it turns into like the nice heat vision that he's got going on there that is so sick dude my man goku is not messing around he said boy i got my laser beam eyes i've always wanted goku to have laser eyes or some kind of like cool laser i mean he got the beam gun like the spirit gun and all that but i mean that's so sick so we still got the alpha kamehameha as you guys know makes a nice uh a lot of sparkles there which it just looks cool and it's got a really got a really <laughs> very thick end there I don't, I don't know why it's so thick but we got the sick aura it just looks so dope and then of course super god fist again another very fitting move just to punch vegeta in the face because you just be like hey vegeta check this out boy bitch <laughs> like let's get it dude Getting him good. Vegeta's just like, ah, shit, my mask's gonna fall off. Dude, wait, hold on. Does Vegeta's mask actually, like, go over his ears? I think it does. Hold on, I gotta see this. Yeah, it does, dude. Oh, actually, the mask is like... Whoa, okay, so the mask is part of his entire costume. Like, the neck, and it connects to the, like, his face and everything. That's kind of cool. I like that. I'm not sure which Batman design this is based off of. Usually, Batman's mask is just a mask, and that's it. It's kind of like, you know, the Incredibles mask, I guess, but... I don't know, dude. I digress. Um, we got Final Charge. I do like the auras on these guys. A nice, basic, whitish blue tint. Very beautiful. And uh, it's just, man, it's so sick. The laser beam eyes are really the best. It's got great range, too. Look at that. You see that range? Look at this shit, bro. Boom. It's huge range. That's insane, dude. That's absolutely nutty bears. So let's go ahead and try out uh, all three of the Super Saiyan transformations. Just to see them, man, because we freaking can. You already know. But first, we're going to try out Super breath let's see that one right there oh crap wait what oh that is sick dude i like that i like that a lot look at this so he does he does the point dude he does the point what is that all about man so i think that's uh what is it android 13 does that kind of point and it makes this like cool effect and then he uses like oh and it freezes him too that is sick dude it actually frees him so it is ice breath 100 percent ice breath that is so sick so it's got the uh symphonic uh, destruction or whatever is that what it's called the, 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 that move or something like that it's something like that bro that is freaking dope i am i'm a fan of it big fan big fan so as you guys know final charge it increases slowly uh actually increases quickly over time uh as it goes up but we got our super saiyan transformations here boom a nice super oh i like the colors on this this make his freaking colors look really good so the red is a lot more accentuated there the blue turns into like a tealish and he does have the revamped super saiyan hair which Oh my god, may I say, his re the revamped Super Saiyan here for Goku always looks so much goddamn better. Like, my goodness, it is beautiful. So, I think he has all three of his uh, transformations here. So, he's got a little bit of a Super Saiyan 2 effect. Yes, ooh, I think Super Saiyan 2 fits perfectly. That's the best one, bro. That really is. Like, look at that. You see this? Do you see this, man? Got the hair, you know, the three strands, real spiky. Got the electricity. We're looking fly, bro. We're looking great. All right, Super Saiyan 3 in 3, 2, 1. My ultimate form. Super Saiyan 3 doesn't get a lot of love these days. So now it's good to see that we finally got it going on. My man is buff. He is ready to go. He's lacking eyebrows. You already know what's about to go down. Let's go for that grab. You're wide open. It isn't over yet. You're wide open and it isn't over yet. Okay, all right, bitch. <laughs> Boom, we got our stamina breaks. You already know it, but... Other than that, uh, last final move that we got to showcase for my man Kukauku, Goku, is going to be the super laser beam. What the fudge is going on? Oh my god. Hold on, hold on. Can I see that again? Can I just see that? That was a little bit nut. Two nutty bears for the bears of nuts, all right? Look at that. I love the stance, bro. He got the stance going on. He goes for a hit, and then it turns into... What is that, dude? What, that looks familiar. It's kind of like Revenge Final Flash. That's what it kind of looks like. Look at this stance. Is this not sick? This is so fitting for him, dude. I love... The stance is perfect. So, he goes in. He does this weird uh, shockwave effect or whatever, which I love the colors on it. It's got the red at the very end, and then behind him, it's got this green effect. And then he goes for a huge-ass laser beam, 
coming out of his eyes, which is like Revenge Final Flash or something like that. That's what it kind of looks like. But it's in terms of it like being like a red color. Wow, that is the coolest thing. Both of these are so sick. I love these, bro. I like how they have custom, like, stance and animations going on there. Well, like, not super custom, but you know what I mean. Like, they're, like, you know, taken from other things, and they, they kind of mix into it. Dude, I love Goku's shit, bro. It, it looks awesome, man. It really does. All right, let's go and shout out Vegeta here. Uh, as you guys know, Vegeta, he's probably going to have his basic moveset. I got to see the kick. You already know. The kick is very important. That's the one I like, dude. That's the one I am a big fan of. Dude, can we get a little bit of triangle square up in this? Boom, 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 boom. Oh, you already know it. My man Vegeta is extending. Dude, we go all the way and we go boop, 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 like that. All right, Big Bang Launcher. Oh, yes, dude. Big Bang Launcher is so sick. I love this one. It's got like the black outline on the edges. Oh, that's so sick, bro. Well, let's try it one more time. Let me, sh let me just show you guys frame by frame how cool this move looks. You see this? The black, like, just ring of death behind him it's so fitting for batman and and vegeta at the same time and this has got blazing attack i don't know why i put that on there i just love this move so much it's just so satisfying it's so prominent you know the prominent flash yes <laughs> oh my god let me just tell you all my experience with batman versus superman it was actually not too bad a lot of people give it hate it wasn't too bad it was pretty shitty though <laughs> all right and there you go battering oh crap and it's actually i think it actually shows a bat so it's um what is that move called something bridge or something i can't remember it's it's the one from uh android 17 i think does it actually i think it does have a battering right it freaking does it's literally a green battering is that cool is that not the sickest shit ever bro look at that man that's insane and it spins too the spinning fidget spinner of death and it's pretty big it's actually massive so yeah uh good good choice of it because that move is like a boomerang on its own too and it's just so satisfying it does so much damage too my god like Pretty nutty bears. Pretty nutty bears. All right, let's go and get the key back down to normal here. I want to try out our burning strike again. Another fitting move. A nice big kick to the face. Uh, you know, shout out to the Trunks for his burning strike. And then we have Gamma Prominence Flash. A little bit of a recolor. Got some uh, purples in there and everything, but still very fitting. It just looks cool. A lot of the uh, God Vegeta moves, because they're newer, it just, I like it, man. I like it. It's fun. And, you know, we finally have the skills that we can use for, uh, you know, these characters now. Because before it would get glitched out. But we got our Super Vegeta transformation here. Uh, I wish Super Vegeta 2 actually showed some kind of difference in his hair. But it doesn't, unfortunately. That's just how it is. Uh, mainly just the electricity that pulsates from him. Um, I don't even think... Is Super Vegeta 2, like, a real thing? Is it, like, actually canon? I feel like I feel like it is, right? I, I would assume it is. But other than that, my friends, I mean, it's basically Goku and Vegeta in their super-powered forms with basic Super Saiyan transformation. I love Blue and God and all that great stuff and Ultra Instinct and Blue Evolution. Don't get me wrong, but I'm going to be honest. It is kind of nice to uh, just be able to focus on the original... Uh, forms that they had in Z and everything and Big Bang Launcher is such a great move, bro I really do like it. So other than that my friends We're gonna go ahead and jump into the versus mode and do a full-on Batman versus Superman showcase Alright, my friends, so went ahead and threw on them revamped textures. My boys are going to be looking clean in this day and age. You already know it. And, uh, you know, just because I'm going to start doing that from now on. So what I'll do is the beginning, we'll keep our traditional stuff. Vegeta. And then we'll get into the Sorry, new revamped kind of texture power. just to make it look a little bit you different. And, you know, just to change it up. And I know there are people that don't like the textures and there are people that do. So I'm trying my best, guys. Hopefully I can please as many people as I possibly can. Now, again, you guys know I can't please everyone. It's impossible. There's going to be somebody bitching about something. I already know it. So I'm going to be like, oh, but I have not the right texture. I wanted Allison's texture. Mm, yes. And I'm going to be like, well, guess what? It's just the same textures these are just better like honestly like i know people are like oh okay like what happened you don't want to show those old ones i'm like well i mean because these are just as good if not better and they don't have as much saturation i still like allison's but it's just that allison's is just too much saturation that's all i mean they all look kind of the same they just make that crazy uh deep effect on you know like the the background and stuff or not the background. what am i saying what am i saying the background i don't know it just makes for a cool like unreal engine sort of like variation there you know what i mean you know what i mean oh crap i'll try to go for a my mom and he was like no boy boom look at that dude it looked like he got like he ate chocolate and there's like chocolates on his face that's what sometimes it looks like 
Laser beam. <laughs> laser beam. Alpha Kamehameha. Here we go. Oh, we got a little bit of burst in there, too. I didn't even actually know it had the burst, dude. Oh, crap. He's throwing the battery. You know what, Vegeta? Take that, bruh. Take that. You already know it, dude. Boom. Dude, Dark Knight Vegeta. Just, it's so sick seeing that, dude. He's just kind of chilling back over there. All right, check this shit out. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Oh, crap. He's going for it. He's going for it. I'm going for mine, too. Let's see. Fire or ice? Wow, ice beats fire. Are you kidding me? That is actually lit as all hell, dude, honestly. All right, this is the strategy. I'm going to go for my combos here. Go for one of those and then go like that. Oh, that would have been so sick if I landed it, bro. I'm trying to get him right there, right there whenever I did it. Oh, okay. Hey, you know, Vegeta, I'm going to show you what's really good, homie. Take it. Take it to the freaking Martha Wayne deathbed. All right, my name's my mom's name is Martha, too, so this it's okay. <laughs> that was the dumbest thing ever, dude. Let me know down below. Comment down below, Martha. Just say Martha. That way I know you made it through this video. You already know it, my friend. So, again, big shout-outs to Leon Exodia as well as my boy, Cali Kings. Um, also, I want to specify that it was uh, Leon that made the Goku Man of Steel. And then Cali did the Dark Knight Vegeta, if you guys wanted specifics on that. But uh, please go check him out. Love these guys so much. They're such great friends in the community. I've known them for several years. Probably probably over over four years now or over three years at least. So um, just go check them out. Support them, please. And just tell them that they're amazing individuals and they're talented as hell and that uh, you love them. All right? Give them, show them some love. All right, guys? And just to the entire modding community as well because they're amazing. So uh, be sure to subscribe, leave a like on this video, and ring that notification bell to get instant notifications when new videos go live, my friends. You already know what's about to go down. And have a great day. Peace out. Take care. Love y'all.